Okay, what's next now? Amy and Joe are asked to pick values of num for numbers P, Q, and R so that the following is true for all A. Amy picked three values that were all the same so that P equals Q equals R. Write down the values of P, Q, and R that Amy picked. So I think it has to be 1, 1, 1 because that's the only way that this could be true. Amy. No, no, sorry. I, I'm looking at. I was looking at the A's, not the PQR, so it has to be 444. 444. Write down the values of PQ and R that Amy picked, and she picked them so that P. Yeah, okay. Joe picked three values that were all different. Write down possible values of PQ and R that he could have picked. Well, I guess he could have gone with like 1, 2, and 9. Uh, that's it. Okay. Find the value of m so that the following is true for all b. Okay, so that's a b power 1 here. So when you, you multiply, you add the powers. And then when you divide, you subtract the power. And that's equal to b10. So it has to be m is 13. Because 13 minus 2 minus 1 is 10. All right, that's another question done.